Hello everybody out there on the internet. I'm the Toaster, and today we're going to react to Joji Wanted You. This is the official video, link in the description, check it out before you check me out. I'm excited, you know, I always say in Joji videos how much I love his music and I love him as a person, you know, he's always got such soul-touching music. I always enjoy the vibe, the instrumentals, so it's been a while since I've done a Joji video, I think. I say that every time as well, I know that, but this time it actually has been a while, like maybe four days. I don't even remember which was the last thing I did by him, but I'm happy to get into it. You know, Ballads 1, the album that this song is on, is such a beautiful album. Um, I don't think there's been a single song I've reacted to from this album in particular that I haven't enjoyed. In fact, I don't think I've disliked a single Joji song at the moment. No, I don't think I have. So I'm happy to get into this. I have the lyrics over here if I need them. And I'm ready to get into it. From the sounds of it, it's going to be like another unrequited love song. Kind of like slow dancing of the dark. Um, glimpse of us even. You know, just that somber, heartbreaking sort of sound. But I'm not sure yet, so we'll see. So I'm going to get straight into it. Three, two, one. Let's kick it. I love when Joji does electric guitar. It always works so well. You got a little bit of glam rock in here, do we? You got Kiss by the looks of it, Starman looking eye. You know, I, I love glam rock. It's some of my favorite music, so I'm I'm digging it. I'm digging the visuals. Okay, we're going, we're going so far for, you know, the beautiful, lo-fi sort of heartache song. Um, I've always enjoyed this sort of sound from Joji. I think it's one of his better sort of sounds that he does. But I have enjoyed a lot of his, you know, more aggressive and I guess more needy sort of sounds, if you know what I mean. He has those sounds where he is kind of begging for usually of a girl. This one is more of his like calm, saddish ones. And it's probably my favorite, like I said. I do really enjoy the visuals because, you know, I think he's going for Kiss in particular, but, you know, Glam Rock in general. Um, I don't know if. Is it Starman or Spaceman or something? I know it's something like that for Kiss. Um, but I've always enjoyed that music. So it's, it's a nice homage. They added the little shimmer effect that a lot of glam rock bands used to have. And they did like the little starlight twinkle effect. He's embracing it. Um, I don't know if that's purposely for the glam rock, but it works with the video. It's a sad song so far, you know. It's It sounds to me like it is unrequited love because he says stuff like torn into a thousand shapes and folds a thousand ways before I throw a smile your way no more. Um, so... You know, he, he talks about it a lot. I don't know if it's the same girl every time he's talking about it or not, or if it's a fictional girl or what it is. I'm not too sure about his dating history. But I know that whenever he does a song like this, it sounds, you know, from the heart and passionate. And he always makes it seem very intimate and personal. <laughs> I 
love that line. I've been waiting my whole life to know I wanted you. So, you know, he really likes the skull. Um, but it seems like he's not having any luck. Really enjoying the vibe of the song. It's gonna, so far, I think it's like a sleeping song, sort of song I'd have on when sleeping. Um, even though the electric guitar, you know, is a bit more of a twangy, sort of harder picking sound, I guess that's what you call it. I think it still constitutes as a nice, relaxing song so far. I'm not sure if it'll change it up or not. But um, one thing I did really like is the way this chorus goes, how he starts with, you know, he's been wanting her his whole life. But then at the end, it's like, are you feeling me slowly? You can take your effing time. Which I think is just showing that he's willing to wait for her. And he's saying, you know, are you are you starting to get feelings for me? Um, but it seems like just by the vibe and the way he started the song that she isn't even now. I love this, like, drum in the back, this simple beat with the electric guitar, it's really mellow. The blue light. Damn, these visuals are nice. It's a good production, really. But his lyrics always stand out to me because they always have a deep personal feeling, like I mentioned with Joji. Especially that I'm hanging on your noose, pull me up so I can breathe with you. He's like, I guess, dying for this woman. And the only way he can be saved is, you know, if she gives him his, her love. This is for copyright, but um, very nostalgic to watch because it's even like the lasers, the little screens here with like just statues and faces and robots back here, for example. <clears throat> it's all reminiscent of classic music videos. Now, I don't know if there's a meaning behind the video in particular. It might just be a good video, but the way I'm taking it is perhaps he's living like this glam rock lifestyle. You know, he's partying, he's going out doing all this shit and he's not filling the void inside him with the girl so i don't know if there's any meaning but i'm gonna take it as you know he's living a party lifestyle despite his need for the girl and you know he won't be complete without her either way but i don't know Really nice inclusion. Really. 
really enjoyed that guitar solo. Not really a guitar solo. Oh, I mean, it is, I guess. But, you know, the way that it's included in the background, it's a bit muffled. It works really well with Joji's entire style. And I'm glad he included it because I really love electric guitar, especially in songs like this. Bit of an abrupt ending, but we're here for it. <clears throat> well, um, mate, that that got me in a nostalgic mood. You know, it doesn't sound like anything I used to listen to. It's it's Joji's unique sound as always, but the video, the electric guitar, the little star sound effect that he did with the chorus, it's made me want to listen to some glam rock now. Maybe later. Maybe later. Um, we got Depeche Mode coming up eventually, so that'll fill in a bit more nostalgia, hopefully. Uh, but I really enjoyed this song. It, I think it's probably considered underrated. I don't know how popular it is in total compared to his other songs, but I've never heard much about it. So I'd say this is a bit of an underrated song, honestly. It's definitely one of the higher ups on the Ballads 1 album for me. Um, especially just like the ending. The outro feels really nice. He has the confessional, you know, heart pouring out chorus as always. And then the verses are just him talking about his pain, really. So it's what I've come to expect and love from Joji. Um, you know, I props to him because he always impresses me and I always enjoy the relaxing mood of these sort of songs. The electric guitar part, I think I can still listen to while sleeping. So if anything, this will go on a sleeping playlist. But I can definitely hear myself listening to it more just for casual enjoyment as well. So, that being said, if you enjoyed my reaction, please like and subscribe. Um, any comments down below, I'd really appreciate, you know, uh, suggestions, recommendations, information, you know, life anecdotes, poems, whatever you want. I read them all. I usually answer them all. There's a couple I've missed out on answering lately from like a week ago. But I'm going to try and go back soon and answer like every single one because... I really want to engage with the community and answer them. I just sometimes forget and they get flooded. So I will answer them eventually, you know. Otherwise, I will have a social media up tonight. I'll post it in my community section and I'll probably mention it in some videos later on. Um, but otherwise, you can reach me by email, either the official email on the channel or I have a separate email for this channel specifically in the description of every video. So thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed. And with that... I'll catch you later.